Video Games A culture beloved by young and old. From Mario to Call of Duty, video games have been some of the best entertainment of the past 30 years. But a lot of video games are based around multitasking, trying to do multiple things at once. In games, the player will have to watch their life bar and also try to complete the objective. What we will be testing is if the player can multitask between something in real life and the game at the same time. The testing will be based around the five senses, sight, smell, hearing, touch, and taste. Our prediction is that the senses will affect the player a noticeable amount. To experiment, we will be making the player eat hot Cheetos, play with a red and spooky background, wear orange glasses, listen to two types of music, and use a sticky controller. The two games we'll be, we'll, we will be using is Smash Brothers, a skill-based fighting game, and Mario Maker, a platforming game. On to the experiment. After looking at all the data, I would say that the senses do not affect the way we play games in the short term. I'm sure if someone played for an hour or two, you could see the effect. But in two or three minute games, it does not affect the player all too much. As you can see, both graphs are all over the place. Anything that you think is a pattern is just pure coincidence. Special thanks to all people that helped us with this experiment, especially our test subjects.